Hey, Phyllis. I thought I told you to stay the hell out of my stuff. I saw what you wrote about Samuel. Fine. I guess you might as well hear the whole thing. My grandson Samuel and I were on our own since my daughter died. I managed to get us in on a farm. Hard on these old bones, but it kept us fed. I was on watch one night. I... I don't... I'm sitting there with a gun across my knees, looking out over the hill, and... and I think I fell asleep. It, it's just blank. The next thing I remember is the sound of a gunshot shaking me out of it. And Samuel is at my feet, and there's blood everywhere. Go on. There's nothing else to tell. Everyone came running out. But it was just me and Samuel. No raiders. No gunners. Just blood. One moment he was there. And then the next... Just gone. Those little fingers that used to hold my hand. And it's all my fault. You can't imagine what that's like. You're right. I don't know, because I've never murdered my own family before. Fuck you. I didn't ask for you to pass judgment. It's gonna be your last thing. Anyway. Hey. Yep. Don't mind the clutter. <laughs> 